Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be another day in the life vlog. It's midday, Lainey and I just got back home. We went and scooped up some Chick-fil-A for lunch. I had a Cobb salad and she had her usual chicken nuggets with mac and cheese instead of french fries and a lemonade. But um, I really wanted to film this video today and I've been excited to do it. If you follow me on Instagram, you already know our big surprise slash announcement. Our family has grown by four little paws. This is our new little family member. She's a bull terrier, AKA the target dog, AKA the Spuds McKenzie. Budweiser dog, I just woke her up from a nap to film this. She is the best. We've known about this little pooch since September. We recently decided that, you know, since we're not having any more babies, we still wanted to add somebody to our family. So we decided to add a little puppy. And um, we got a bull terrier because Kevin brought the breed up to me and said that he's always thought that these dogs were super cool and He's always wanted one. So we looked for a couple of breeders. I found one in Houston and one in Fort Worth. We went with the litter in Fort Worth because the breeder isn't actually a breeder and this little puppy's mom and dad are their family pets and this is their first litter. So I found them on Craigslist and we got pick of the litter. We picked her because she had a eye patch just like Ariel. And when we first picked her, her eye patch was actually all black. But as she got a little bit older, it turned out to be Brindle. So she's got some little tiger stripes. So um, she was born on September 20th. And I'm filming this on November 20th, so she's exactly two months old today. Her ears are not all the way up yet. Their ears do naturally stand up straight and that should happen between four and six months, but they're on their way there because the bottom half is already standing up and the top half is just a little floppy. So, um, she's so sleepy here. Oh, she's just like a brand new baby. So her name is Lila Billy. Lila Billy. She has two names basically because we couldn't decide between Lila and Billy. So we just named her both. <laughs> I'm gonna go put her down really quick so that she can take a snooze because she's like barely staying awake. Okay, yeah, she's like very much like a baby where she just wants to sleep all day. But we decided to name her Lila Billy because Lila and Billy were the only two names out of like the 25 that I suggested to Kevin. Those were the only two names that he liked and we had such a hard time deciding between the two. So we ultimately, ultimately were just like, let's just call her Lila Billy. So Lila Billy Ferguson is her name. We sometimes call her Lila Billy, but typically we just call her Lila. But she's the perfect addition to our family. We are in puppy heaven, but we're also in the oh crap, puppy stage because you forget how hard having a new puppy is. The first few nights were really rough. She cried a lot. Um, and we have Ariel who is eight and you know, she has always been the only dog. So after the first few nights, we felt really bad and we had Ariel take one for the team and we put Ariel in the laundry room with Lila. So Lila's room is the laundry room. We have a kennel in there, but we don't lock her in it because she's never been in a kennel. Uh, she wasn't kennel trained from the get-go like that. She just slept in a big room with her brothers and sisters. So we just leave the kennel open. We've got her dog bed in there, her blanket, her toys. We put a puppy pad on the floor because she is trained to puppy pads right now. Um, so we just put Ariel's bed in the laundry room with her and it was the first time that she didn't cry at night. So poor Ariel has been used to just roaming the house and sleeping wherever she wants, but she's a big sister now. So she's sleeping with her little sister, Lila, and it's actually been going really great. Lila sleeps through the night. I feel like I'm talking about a newborn. Um, she sleeps through the night. She doesn't cry with Ariel in there, and Ariel's been such a trooper. Ariel doesn't cry in there either. She just, you know, has accepted her role as big sister and has been handling it like a champ. She's also just been great all the way around. She's really accepted Lila. She's accepted Lila since the minute we brought her into the house. Um, they play, they sleep together, they coexist really well. The only time Ariel gets annoyed is if she's eating and Lila 
tries to come up and eat out of her bowl. But that's, I feel like that's pretty normal. Um, but she hasn't been aggressive or jealous or anything. And we made it a point to tell our kids when we bring the new puppy home, Ariel might be very sad. So it's very important that we still give her lots of love and attention so that she doesn't get, you know, upset or jealous of the new puppy. So things have been going really great. Oh, okay, maybe in just a little bit. Lainey, come here. What? What do you think about our new puppy? <laughs> what do you think about our new puppy? Do you love her? What's her name? Lila Billy, you love having a new puppy? Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's just a button. Mommy. You're welcome, Bye. sister. Bye, baby. <laughs> so yeah, if you guys follow me on Instagram, I already announced it there and I've been sharing pictures and videos of her. I did film a little bit on my phone and on my camera when we first got her and brought her home and then our first weekend with her. So I will include those clips in this video um, so that you guys can see, but I just wanted to come on here first and introduce you to our new pup, let you know how it's been going. And um, I'm, I'm really excited that we have her. I think she's a perfect fit. I love her name. Oh, I wanted to say this about her name. So, her name is spelled L-Y-L-A, or Lila, and it's great because we have Alexi and Eleni, so we stuck with the L theme for Ariel. She can't, she had her name before there was all these L's for girls. So, um, and then Billy is spelled with an I-E to make it more girly and not so boyish. And my sister actually came up with Billy, or suggested Billy, um, for like Billy the Bully, because she's a Bull Terrier. And I think that some um, people who own bull terriers call them bullies, and they're not bullies. The breed, I did a lot of research on the breed before we um, settled and decided to get this dog, and they are, they look intense and, um, and very strong and kind, like they could be really tough, but they're actually a very, very sweet breed. Um, I did read that they are very hyper the first few years and that they, need to be around people like they're not good to be left alone like they're not the kind of dog that's good for you to have if nobody's going to be home throughout the day like if you both of you and your partner work they do a lot better if somebody's stays home all day so that was perfect for us because i stay home all day and i can see that she is very um she wants to be touching somebody at all times she's very needy in that way but we like it she's very much a cuddler um but uh anyways i got off track billy is because of baby Billy from The Righteous Gemstones. So Kevin and I loved Vice Principals on HBO. We um, liked Eastbound and Down and we liked The Righteous Gemstones on HBO. So if you haven't watched any of those shows, you should definitely go watch it. If you like comedy, like very um, silly, like in your face, forcefully kind of funny shows that you don't take too seriously. And two, all those shows have similar castmates in each show. And the character that plays Baby Billy in The Righteous Gemstones was also in Vice Principals and we just love him as a character. He's so funny. So Kevin was like, please, Billy has to be in her name so I can call her Baby Billy. So that's kind of where, um, why the name stuck too. But um, I've been chatting a lot about this dog and some of you probably do not give two craps that we got a new dog. But we're super excited about the dog and I wanted to talk to you guys about it and just get it out in the open. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and insert some of those clips I was telling y'all about from this past weekend and when we first got Lila now. Hey, where are we going guys? Lila. Lila? Who's Lila? What is Lila? A bull terrier. A bull terrier? Are we getting a puppy today? Lainey, are we getting a puppy today? Are you excited? What's her name? Lila Billy. Lila Billy. Ariel. Ariel, it's your new sister. Lila's like, oh, another one of me. Did we just become best friends? We did. You better get ready. Ariel, are you excited? Let's go. Ariel's the best dog. Yeah, she's swinging her tail. She's at me, What do you think of your new sister?
Lila. Hi, little baby. You got an acorn? Hi, baby. So cute. Hi, Lila Billy. Go get it, Lainey. Go get it. See how I'm holding it? Pull it like this. Like this. You want to throw it in the hole? Like this. Careful, don't hit Lila. Lila. Lila, get off of there. Come here. I did it! Okay. Go. Jason, is she licking you? Oh, you! Oh, she's gonna bite your nose. <laughs> Let me see you, Kason. Oh my gosh. Go to the fence. Your tummy's hurting. Oh, okay. You gonna be all right? My dog's so coming. Your what? My dog's so coming. I don't know what you're saying. Where are we going on Friday? The movies. The movies? What are we gonna see? The new Frozen. The new Frozen. Were you so excited? Oh my gosh, it's gonna be great. We're we going on a family date night to go see Frozen too. Yay! I'm. So the movie theater is so dark so that we can see the movie. We're gonna be so cozy and watch the movie. Mm -hmm. I'm so excited. At the seat yep, we're gonna get our own seats. Yay! Um, what what kind of snack do you want to get at the movie theater? What do you see? Popcorn. Popcorn? Mm -hmm. What do you want to drink at the movie theater? Icy. An icy? Wow, you have it all figured out, don't you? I'm going to mall. Um, we're gonna go. We can go to the movies and get an icy on Friday. <laughs> and see the new Frozen too. Yes. So here's this sweet little pooch. I just got her blanket out of the washer and dryer, and her bed is actually still in the laundry room. So I just brought her blanket in here. And there's Ariel. Lainey, look how sweet Lila is. This is one of Lila's favorite toys. It's a lamb chop. <laughs> did anybody used to watch the show when they were little? Because I know I sure did. <laughs> Anyways, you can get the lamb chop toys at PetSmart. That's where oh, I got that one. Yeah, that's her tongue. That is her tongue. That's her tongue. I just realized that today is Wednesday when I'm filming this. I'll probably upload it today as well because this is going to be kind of just like a short and chatty vlog. Um, it's been a week since Lila came home. It's, it's Lila's one week anniversary of being home, Lainey. Since we just got her and it's only been a week, we've been very much homebodies and really just hanging out on the couch here at home with her and getting her acclimated to the house and getting used to a routine and everything like that. One of our favorite things to do while we sit on the couch 
is watch Disney Plus. Oh my gosh, Disney Plus. Why did it take Disney so long to come out with their own streaming service? Because Disney Plus is one of the best things that we've purchased in a very long time besides Lila. I've been having the kids watch all of the Out of the Vault movies. Lainey, what are we watching right now? Frozen. No, this isn't Frozen. What movie is this? John? Pocahontas. Pocahontas. Yeah, we watch in Pocahontas. Mommy, I don't like that movie. You don't like it? Why? I don't like that one. Oh, but Pocahontas is so beautiful and she lives out in the forest. She's in the forest. Yeah, she got a pet raccoon. A pet raccoon? Yeah, he's so cute. It's like a baby. It's like her baby and she got a little hummingbird. Yeah, she does. So, we've just, you know, been lounging around and in puppy heaven and just hanging out. But one thing too, I have started very early. This is totally off the subject. I just feel like I'm just gonna chat you guys up today and just tell you all the random <laughs> updates that I have to tell you. Um, so I don't know what got into me this year, but it's November 20th and I'm almost done Christmas shopping. And when I say almost done, I mean like with my kids. I never ever start shopping before Black Friday. I typically just stay home on Black Friday and place all of their Christmas present orders online on Black Friday. And I actually started a couple of weeks ago and I'm almost done with them. And being almost done with the kids is practically like being almost done with Christmas shopping in general because they're obviously, we obviously buy the most presents for them. Um, and it feels awesome. I feel like I'm gonna like be super chill and really, really enjoy the Christmas holiday this year because I won't have to worry about stressing over buying presents. Hey baby, Lainey, what do you want for Christmas? We want Santa Claus to bring you. Elsa dress. An Elsa dress? And a ton of frozen. You want a new costume? What else do you want for Christmas? A Christmas dress. A Christmas dress. We did get her Christmas dress in. I ordered it from Matilda Jane. It's so cute. <laughs> so we already have a Christmas dress. What, what What else do you want for Christmas? What kind of toys do you want for Christmas? The Anna toy. You want an Anna toy? You want new Frozen Barbies? Mm -hmm. Wow. Uh -huh. Oh, you want him to have the new shoes on? Mm, yeah. <laughs> wow, she really likes her dress up close. New frozen shoes. New frozen shoes? Yeah. Okay. All right, guys. Well, that's going to be it for today. Actually, I mainly just wanted to intru introduce you guys to the puppy and let you know how um, things have been going. I have a lot of video ideas coming up. Let me know if you want to see. I do, I've been doing for the past couple years a What I Got My Kids for Christmas. So some of you moms may um, want to see that for some ideas. I know it might. <laughs> you tickling me? Um, you might want to see that video. That video tends to do really well each year. Um, I also need to do an updated favorites and share all of my like beauty favorites that I've been loving recently. And what else? There was another. Oh, and I am going to do a video on my latest Louie. Um, I need to do another handbag video and I haven't shared that video yet. One, because I just haven't filmed it yet, but also I really wanted to use the bag and be able to give you guys a good review on it. So a review and what fits inside will be uh, coming soon for that. I'm gonna try to film that tomorrow, but Every time I say I'm gonna film a video on a certain date, it never happens. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed um, seeing our new family member and seeing our new surprise. What are you doing? <laughs> um, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little vlog. Uh, thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you guys again next time. Say bye bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs>